Hey, art friends, I got my cool little checkers with me. Dude, what are we going to do today? We're going to fold a spider. Yeah, we're going to fold a really cool spider. <laughs> <laughs> do it to me, Austin. Pick your nose, and then say, Roar! Roar! <laughs> All right, Gigi, you ready to do this spider? Yeah. All right, I'm so excited. This is, can be a really tricky uh, origami spider. We are gonna do some cutting, so we need some scissors. We're gonna use some regular computer paper. And we thought we could try this with black construction paper. Did it work out? No. No, it didn't work out because construction paper is really thick, huh? Yeah. And that's one of the reasons why it's better to use uh, computer paper and then you can color the paper so it's black or any color you want make it spooky, or use black origami paper. Because you really, there's a lot of folds in this and so you're gonna need thinner paper to work with. Okay, you ready to start? Yeah. So we first need to start with a square. Do you remember how to do that? Mm-hmm. All right, let's do it. So what do we, what's the first step? Go, I'm not teaching it, but. <laughs> do it over here so they can see you. Yeah, so you can start with your paper this way. It's a little easier and then you can grab the top right corner and fold it down so that this edge, this top edge, lines up with the side edge, right? Mm -hmm. Are you excited for Halloween, man? Yeah. This is actually what we're doing. We forgot to show them. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. It's really awesome. It's this 3D looking spider. We're gonna do that. So it looks, it's really looks tricky, but we're gonna do it nice and slow and easy so that our art friends can follow along and make it themselves. Okay, you're ready to I cut. So we're getting the square, this square and then we do that by making this triangle first and then we cut off this extra piece, right? And if we go too fast, you can always pause the video. Yes. Actually, and it's really this one. And on this one, yeah, because you may need to pause it, catch up, or you may need to pause it and then rewind it a little bit and watch one of the steps over again because it is tricky. And, but we're gonna we're gonna make it so it's nice and we've easy. Done it, uh, we've practiced a couple times, huh? It was really hard yeah. for us. <laughs> no, we me. yeah, but we're gonna make it easier this time, huh? Yeah, because we use uh, we used the construction paper and it was hard. Okay, so now we're gonna open it back up, and then we're gonna fold fold it this way. Okay. We had fun decorating our studio, huh? Yeah. With this video. Mm -hmm. You got all our spooky stuff out. All right, we got it open back up after you fold that. And then we're gonna flip it over, okay? And then we're gonna fold it in half. You wanna make sure that all the edges are lined up nice, nice and straight, whoops. And each corner lines up just right. Okay, did you already open it up? Okay, hold on, wait for me. Oops, mine isn't lined up. I need to redo it. One sec. There we go. Ooh. Okay, now I'm caught up. All right, so you can use your finger to really crease it well, too. And then you do Open it up, it. and then we're going to flip it this way and fold it the other way, right? Mm -hmm. Good. You remember yeah, from I our remember practice, from huh? Practice. Okay. A lot of it, but not all of it. Not all of it. After this time, maybe we'll remember everything. So, now we got that. Did you open it back up? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to leave it how it is. We're not going to flip it back over. We're going to have it like a diamond, and we're going to pinch this together. You right? can use any, any... Do it over here so they can see you. corner. This one, this one, and this one. Right. Just have it like a diamond, and then pinch the right corner together. This. Scoot it up here so they can see you. We're zoomed in, so it's a little harder to... Keep it in the camera and then we're going to fold it down and then that kind of makes a little almost like a little box okay. All right. okay so now the next thing is we're going to grab this corner that's up here and we're going to do the same kind of thing fold it down and then we're going to fold this and kind of squash it all together so it should make a smaller diamond good yeah you did it good job man all right. Like one of those, um, so now we got it. Folds. Yeah, squash fold. And then we we've got it opened up at the bottom. Okay. Wait. So do it over here so they can see. You got to make sure you remember to keep okay. it in there. And then we're gonna fold this this side to the middle. 
So how many legs does the spider have? Eight. Yeah, and that's what kind of makes this a little tricky is because you repeat a lot of the same folds over and over again so that we can make all eight of the legs. And then I'm doing the other side. Yeah, Are you doing that too? So we're folding that, this edge, to the middle. And then don't you flip then, it over and oh yeah. do the same thing? Flip it over and then do the same thing. Do it up here, man. Oh, I keep on forgetting. <laughs> it's, it's, it's I'll keep reminding you. <laughs> I, will, I will keep reminding you. Don't you worry. <laughs> okay, and then we're going to fold that and we'll fold the other side too so that both sides look exactly the same. All right, we got it? Okay, yeah. so keep it this way and then we're going to open it up. We'll open this side up first and then we're going to take this first page, okay? Oh, so we're going to we're going to pretend that these flaps are pages and we'll keep calling them pages through the whole video, okay? So we're going to open this page up and put our finger in there, in between, let me tip it up so you can kind of see. So I put my finger in there and then we're going to squish it down and then fold it together. So we turn that one page into two pages now. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. You got it? Yeah. My fingers aren't as long as yours. <laughs> it's okay. So, so hold on. So let's open it up. Open it up and get that crease in there nice nice and crisp. Okay, and then we'll open it back up. We'll put our thumb in there. And then you're going to push that in like that and then fold it back. Okay? So I'll let you do the next one, okay? We're gonna do the left side. Okay, so we're gonna do the same thing. Grab the page on the left, put your thumb in there and open it up and then you can kind of squash it down like that and then fold it back in. So we've got two pages now. So that, like yeah. that and then... Okay, so keep that creased. So open it up, open it all the way up all the way up like that. Yeah, good job. You did it. Okay, now we're gonna flip it over. And, do the same and we're thing. gonna do the same, those both, the same thing that we did on that side, we're gonna do it on this side. So we'll take the right page, open it up, and then you can squash it down and then fold it back in. There you go. I'm gonna fold. I'm gonna do this one. Open it up. Open it all the way up. Squash it down. And fold the page back. So now we should have four four pages on this side, four pages on this side, right? Mm -hmm. Does that sound like a spider? Four pages are gonna turn into four legs. Mm -hmm. So you want to be careful when you open it up. You don't want to open everything up. Yeah. Okay, that squash squash that down the... and then fold it back. You're like, you're like so good at it and then I keep on like up. <laughs> it's okay. It's practice. That's why you're doing it with me, huh? Yeah. So let's, let's tip it like this and count how many pages we got on each side. We four. want to make sure we have four. Four. Yes, four on each side, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So now we're going to do, we're going to start making the legs and... We're gonna take the right, the first right page, and we're gonna flip it over. So it should look like this, okay? And then we're gonna come in here and make this. This edge right here, we're gonna fold to the middle of our paper, okay? And do the same thing. And we're gonna do the same side. thing on the other side. You're right. Pretty much remember it, but in some, but I still like. Uh, mess up on it, but I, re it's okay. I remember it. Yeah, you remember the steps. Mm -hmm. Okay, we've got that folded in. Okay, now we're going to open it up. Let's scoot it up a little more. There you go. And then we're going, to, this is, this is a little tricky, but it's not too bad. 
So we're going to put our thumb inside and then put our little finger right there, first finger, and start opening it up. Okay, and then when, when we open it up, you can take these two flaps on the side and push them down. So I'm going to do this part slow so that we can make sure our art friends do it with us. Okay. I think I, I, think I already got so it last, now that, last time. It was so hard. Yeah. Okay, so now that we've got it like this, we've got to make two new folds kind of towards the top. So I'm going to take my fingers and... We're going to open, we'll do one side at a time, how about that? We're going to fold it open, kind of squish it. So we'll do the same on this side. It's getting all wrinkly. Squish it. So it should look like that. This is a little tricky. We're going to do it a couple more times so our art friends can watch. We'll, and I'll try and do it a little easier the next time or easier to watch. So if you push this down, here we go. Let me see what you got. This one's folded over a little bit too much. So let's open it back up. And then we'll make sure that these are folded down. And then we'll kind of straighten those. We got to remake those folds and then push it down like that okay. so it'll lay flat so you kind of have to work with it a little bit just to get it to lay flat but you want you want there to be a little point up here at this top right here so you see that little point mm -hmm. okay now we're going to fold that back so that one's done we're going to fold back over to this side and we'll do the same thing okay, okay. so we'll fold the bottom into the middle You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to zoom in on mine during this part so that maybe our art friends can see it a little bit better. Okay? Okay. All right. And then you can, you don't have to worry about yours being in the shot. So we folded that one. Now we're going to fold this one, this side. And I'm going to do something that might make it a little easier for our art friends. And maybe for me. And maybe for you. <laughs> I'm going to take this this uh, point up here and I'm going to fold the whole thing in half down here to this point and that might make this a little easier to make this fold. Kind of this to the point? Yep. And then that way there's a little fold right here. So I just folded it to the point and then open it back up. Okay, and then we'll open this back up and now that fold should be a little easier to make. Oh, seriously, you know everything. <laughs> you just you just made it easier. Did I? Yeah. Good. I'm so glad. Look, I just did it. It worked. Was that easier? Yes. Yeah, okay. So easy. We'll do that next time. <laughs> so then you just you just want to make sure that that's nice and flat, and then you can fold it back, fold that page back. And we'll start. Now we're back at the beginning. You see how we're making it more of a an actual diamond whole shape, huh? Okay, all right, let's flip it over. All right, and then we're going to fold this page. What? Oh. Yep, and we're going to fold this page back over. And we're going to do and it. repeat. You folded too many pages. Oh. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're going to do the same thing. We'll repeat this, and maybe we'll even speed up some of, this, some of these parts because this is repeating. So it's the same thing we just did. Huh? Oh, seriously. <laughs> So I'm gonna fold this back up to the center. I like to flip it over so I can just boom. It's a little easier when you flip yeah. it upside down. So, you got it. so it looks like that. Oh. And then we still have that fold there, but I'm gonna fold it again in half. And then open it up. And then we'll fold that, open it up, and push these down. Yeah, seriously, that was so easier. Is it? <laughs> Good. All right, so we got go. that. So I'm going to fold the page back. And then I'm going to fold 
the left side over. And we're gonna do it one last time. Wait. Fold this. I'll fold this in. There it is. Or you could just keep on flipping through the, all the pages. Yeah, find... it's a little hard to, if you keep flipping through the pages because then they get all stacked up on one side. So it's nice to fold it back and then flip it over. Okay, so I'm folding that back. Okay, now I'll open it up. Fold this up. Going... And then... Way too fast. Am I going too fast? Mm -hmm. This is where they composite if we're going too fast, huh? Yeah. Oops, there we go. And this side. This one didn't make a very, didn't really make a point up at the top, but that's okay. It's a little flat there. Now we'll fold it back. Awesome! Wait. Now we got a diamond, we got an actual diamond. You got it? I'm gonna zoom back out. Yeah, I'm working on it. There we go. Why is this hard? Alright, we'll speed it up. I don't know how it's harder now. Hmm? Maybe it just crumbled up. Hmm. There. there you go. Alright, you got it. Yeah. Okay, then fold the page back. Oh, you got pages open on both sides. So let's see. Let's get it back so we're in the same spot. So when you flip it, you should have four pages on this side and four pages on this side. And we want it so that it's nice and plain on both sides like this. Okay? It shouldn't look like this. You don't want to see that little diamond. Those should all be closed up. Okay? All right. Okay, so now we're going to take this top page and we're going to flip this up. This is where we're going to make eight legs and we're going to cut it. Okay? okay. So we're going to cut right down the middle of this page. Or flap or whatever you want to call it. And then you're going to cut right to that center where we've folded it right there. Okay? Got it? Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're going to flip it over, and we're going to do the same to this guy. So we've got this little flap, we're going to cut right in the middle, and this is going to make eight legs. So we have four of these, and we cut four in half, what does that make? Eight. Yeah, four is half of eight, huh? Have okay, so we got two there and we got two on this side. Okay, so now we're gonna fold one, two, and we'll have another one. Okay, oh, that's crazy. <laughs> so we're gonna cut this one. All right, you fold it up. Got it? Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Now fold them back down. Oh, yeah. If you got little strings hanging off, you can pull them off if you want. Okay. Fold those legs down, back down to where they were. Then we're going to fold the pages back. So one, two. So we're back to where we started, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So two. now we're going to fold two this way. One, I did. I did two. It. Oh, did you? Okay. And then we should have another one. This is the last flap that we need to cut. Cut right to the middle. And if your scissors don't reach, you can kind of tear it the rest away. Just get it to the middle. You got it? Mm -hmm. Good job, man. Okay, we're almost there. We're getting really close. We're about halfway. All right, so we're gonna. So I fold, folded two pages back, turned two pages back. So now we should still have side. four on this side, four on this side, okay? And then it looks plain this way. Mm -hmm. All right, so watch this. We're gonna fold one page over, and we're gonna flip the whole thing over, and then fold one page over the same direction. 
So if we turn it this way, we should now have four pages and four pages, right? Oh, that's weird. <laughs> it's tricky, huh? So if you stay with us and do everything we're doing, then you should be in the same spot. And if not, you can rewind and see where, where you missed the spot. All right, so we've got all these legs, all right? We're ready to make them thinner, okay? Uh -huh. So we're gonna take the same edge right here, and we're gonna repeat this a lot, just like we've done. We're gonna fold that to the middle. We're gonna make all the legs of the spider really thin. Okay, and then we're gonna do the other side. And then we'll flip a page and we'll do more. That's tricky, huh? Because you wanna kinda want it to look really nice when you're all done so that the legs look nice and sharp. Okay. So we got them, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's flip over. We'll flip this way. Let's flip right page over. One, two, and we should look, it should look exactly the same. So we're gonna speed this up, but we're gonna fold, we're gonna fold these legs, okay? Okay. Right now. <laughs> Okay, cool, you got it. Okay, now we're gonna fold back the two pages. One, two, and we're gonna fold two more. Which way? Sorry, did you fold back? Nope, so you go this way. One, two, and you're where I'm at now. So now we're gonna do two more. One, two. Yes, and should look the same. And we'll <laughs> speed this part up. We're gonna do the same thing. Get those legs really skinny. Cool, you got it. Okay, now we're gonna go back. Ready? One page, two page. And we're back where we started. Two page. Okay, now we're gonna flip it over and should look exactly the same. Oh, we got one more. This is the last one, okay? We can speed this up, but we're gonna fold those edges in just like we've done with all the other legs, okay? Okay. Let's speed it up. You got it. Okay, we're almost done, I promise. Okay. <laughs> it's so awesome, huh? So now we've got all, these are gonna be all the legs up here at the top. This is gonna be the back of the body, okay? So this is kind of what it's looking like, huh? So we're getting close. So here we go. We're gonna fold the back so that it looks like the kind of round, not sharp, huh? Like a mm -hmm. spider. So we're gonna fold the point into the other point right here. Do it up here. They can see you. There you go. Squish it. And then squish it down it's nice and tight. You want it to stay folded. Okay, and then we're gonna flip it over. This is gonna be the top of our spider, okay? Okay. Now let's start building the we're gonna start folding the legs. So we're gonna take this first leg right here. I'm gonna zoom in on my side, is that all right? Yeah, and I could just look over to yours. Yeah. Okay, there we go. All right, so we're gonna take this first leg and we're gonna fold it back in. So it's sticking out. And you want this side in the middle to be right, you want it right there at the where we cut, all the way to where we cut. Okay, and then this I'm gonna fold. I'm gonna fold it off so that it's pointing out. Actually, I'm gonna fold it down even more, a little more. There we go. I'll put it right there. Okay, now we're gonna do the other side, and it's a little easier if you keep a thumb kind of in the middle. That'll keep everything together. So we're gonna do the same, fold it down, and you want it to look symmetrical. So you want same them, as on each side. Yeah, on same side. on both sides, huh? Mm -hmm. Fold that so it's flat. It got wrinkled. I don't know how why it wrinkled. There we go. And so we're pointing off in the same direction. Okay, got it? Mm -hmm. All right, so now we're gonna fold the next leg and we want the inside to be in the same spot. So right there, we want it to be in the same spot, but then we're gonna have the leg point in a slightly different direction, so they're kind of fanning out, making the 
this fan. Okay? Okay. Then we're going to do the other leg the same way. So it's symmetrical. So we point it in the same direction and you can squish it down. Got it? Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. The next leg, we'll grab it and then do the same fold and have it pointed off in even further direction. And we'll do the same on this side. It's looking so awesome, huh? Yeah. That looks so cool. Okay. You got it, good job. Okay, now we're gonna do the last legs and these are a little trickier because we want them pointing kind of forward. So we're gonna have it point like that. Okay, and then we're gonna do the same on this side. Try to make it go forward. There we go, it should look like that. How's yours looking? Awesome. Almost. You're doing really, you you're really one. close. These ones are a little tricky. I think it's easy if you bend it kind of like that. So if you stick your thumb right there and you do the other one, but I'll do this one for you. There you go, like that. So we'll do this one. This one you kind of already did, huh? We'll mm -hmm. just make it a little crisper. There you go. That looks awesome. It's looking really good. Okay, we got one last thing. We're gonna do one more bend on these legs, okay? And we're gonna open them up a little bit. So let's start with this one. We're gonna do just a little bend right here at the end. So it kind of gives them a knee on the leg, okay? So you just kind of twist it. So you grab it like this and then twist and then fold it. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? So grab, grab the leg and then twist it. So it's gonna fold it kind of down like that. Okay, and we'll fold this, this one. Mixed up. The legs? Mm -hmm. That's all right. Okay, and we'll fold that side. It should start looking like he's crawling. And we're gonna do the same on this one. Fold it, fold this side. Yeah, you're going really fast. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they can pause it. You can't pause it though, huh? Yeah, I got to <laughs> You're doing great, man. You're doing a really good job. Okay, and then the last one, fold this one, and we'll do the same. Just bend it so he's got kind of a knee, a joint. We'll bend this side too. More. And then when you we've got them all folded flat like this. Wait, which one was this? That one you fold, you do the same thing. So that's the front one. And you just grab and then bend it like that. Oh. And do the front. Yeah, there are the front one. So you should lay flat. You should be able to lay them flat. And he looks pretty cool like that, huh? Mm -hmm. But we want him to look like he's crawling like this one. So. We just turn them on, you can kind of turn them like this, and then just open up his legs. See that? Kind of move his legs forward, and then we'll flip them over on this side. And you can grab his legs and then just kind of bend them up a little bit more. Open them up. And then he should look like he's crawling. Look at that! That's awesome, huh? Yeah. Where's yours? We gotta see yours. <laughs> That's awesome! Look at those creepy spiders, man. Those are so cool. Did you have fun? Yeah. It was still a little hard, a little difficult, huh? There's lots of little folds that we do over and over again. But if we if we did go too fast, you can always pause it, rewind it, and rewatch the step again. And also leave a comment below. Let us know if this was too hard, if we explained it okay, if you got stuck, or if it was really easy. So that we know in the comments whether we did a good job or we need to work on it and make it better. 
So thanks a lot. We'll see you later, our friends. Bye, our friends. Happy friend. Halloween. Bye. Wow. <laughs> <laughs>cool checkers with me. What are we going to do today? Fold spider. Yeah, we're going to fold an awesome Halloween spider. <laughs> <laughs> are you dancing? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> That's not scary at all. <laughs> That's not scary. <laughs> no, don't dance. <laughs>